That was the finance minister then interacting with Max Olabagba, still on taxes. A law lecturer is calling for effective policies to regulate the tax system in the informal sector. According to Clara Berry Kasati, most micro, small, and medium scale enterprises are overtaxed, hence, they are non compliant. She, however, says majority of the players in the informal sector do not have a problem parting with money, but lack of understanding of how the tax system operates remains the matter. She was speaking at the launch of a research paper by the Ghana Centre for Democratic Development. The Ghana Centre for Democratic Development, in collaboration with the GIG, has unveiled findings from a survey of micro, small and medium enterprises to understand and document the experiences of MSMEs in accessing justice and public services. Speaking at the launch, Lord Lecturer Clara Cassati urged government to implement policies to regulate the tax system in the informal sector. I always make the joke in, the, in my tax class that Ghanaians don't seem to have a problem paying taxes. If you look at the culture, they sow seed all the time. They give first collection, they give second collection. Uh, so if you look, they don't seem, Ghanaians don't seem to have a problem parting um, with money. So that if they understood the tax structure well and believed that it was fair, I believe that they would be they good corporate citizens. I think we all agree that um, we need to tailor the policies. One, of course, the size of the businesses. And that's certainly, as is evident from the findings, to the gender. It means that women-owned businesses are more in need of information and training on the business processes and probably more encouragement and education on the dangers of entrusting the paperwork to someone else or not following up um, on the paperwork. The research paper dubbed Access to Justice and Public Services Experiences of MSMEs in Ghana was authored by Mavis Zupak Domi and Daniel Amaato. According to Mavis, MSMEs in Ghana do not grow, hence the need for the findings to be taken seriously. These uh, findings are very telling and, and as well as timely uh, because of uh, the budget and reading as the budget as well as um, the after uh, policy guide, trade guide. So um, it's timely for policymakers as well as local assemblies to look into. And the, the worrying part of it is the fact that um, MSMEs are not growing. So that means we have to look into that. And they are, when you look at some of their challenges, you, you would, the, they mentioned capital as well. And when you look at uh, what do they want government to do, they are very much particular about reduction in interest loans and also capacity building around management of businesses and financial management so that tells you that easily tells you why MSMEs are not growing and to be good to look into this